Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. <coughs> In this video, we are going to show that uh, if a differential equation has uh, two, so if a second order differential equation has two solutions, then uh, the linear combination of the two solutions should also be solution. So let a a y double dash plus v y dash plus c y equal to zero is a, a second order differential equation with constant coefficient and y one is equal to e lambda one t y two is equal to e lambda 2t are solutions of one then y is equal to c1 y1 plus c2 y2 is also solution so y dash will be c1 y1 dash plus c2 y2 dash and y double dash should be c1 y1 double dash c2 y2 double dash put n1 we have uh, <clears throat> a c1 y1 double dash plus c2 y2 double dash b c1 y1 dash c2 y2 dash and c c1 y1 plus c2 y2 Okay. Now <coughs> choosing C1 coefficient that is A Y1 double dash plus B Y1 dash plus C Y1 coefficient of C2 A Y2 2 double dash b y uh, 2 dash plus c y 2 we know that uh, y1 y2 are the solution so this quantity is 0 that is c1 into 0 c2 into 0 and that is equal to 0 uh, which shows that y which I define c1 y1 plus c2 y2 is solution. We can extend this uh, concept with the for the <coughs> inth order linear differential differential equation with constant coefficient so what we get there we will have n solution y1 y2 y3 and y n are solutions of a <coughs> n y n a n minus 1 y n minus 1 plus a1 y dash plus a naught y equal to 0. If they are the solution we have to show that y is equal to c1 y1 c2 y2 up to cn y n is solution of 
equation 2 so it is very easy to show that um, uh, put this uh, put into we have a n c1 y1 day uh, n c2 y2 uh, n up to c n y n n Similarly, a n minus one and uh, c one y one n minus one c two y two n minus two up to c n y n n minus one. So we have to change a little bit the. Um, the index let's leave that one and uh, up to let me put on the last one this one a nod c1 y1 c2 y2 up to c n y n and uh, collecting Collecting the coefficient of C1, that will be a n y1 n, a n minus 1 y1 n minus 1 up to <coughs> y1. Similarly, collecting the coefficient of C2, a n y2 n. A n minus one y two n minus one up to y two and so on. Collecting the coefficient of c n that is a n y n n a n minus one y n n y n minus 1 and up to plus y n and we know that y1 is the solution y2 is the solution y3 is the solution y n is the solution so that means c1 0 c2 0 up to c n 0 and all are 0 so i get 0 that implies y which we define c1 y1 c2 y2 up to c n y n a solution of 2 okay thank you for uh, watching and uh, this is enough for this video uh, we will continue the um, initial value problem in the next video thank you very much Sorry.